I want you to take amount of money that you'd like to have happen in the next 30 days or by the end of June here. Write down a certain amount of money, 10,000, 100,000, 5,000, 500. Write down the amount of money and then throw it into the chat box. What's a sum of money you'd like to have by the end of the month and make it believable to you. You don't have to say $50 billion, right? <laughs> it, just, it makes something that's you think is like, this this gets me excited and it gives me a little nervous. I, I feel really good about that thing by the end of the month. Go ahead and throw that in. Okay, lots of great amounts. We got 10,000s, we got 25,000s, we got 30,000, 50,000, 5,000, 40,000. We've got a lot of stuff going on here. It's great. On a scale of one to 10, how much do you believe that you can have that by June? Hold on, before we do, remember, there's a belief at two levels. Consciously, you could say, oh, I believe, of course. I know this stuff. It's all possible. Of course, I'm a 10. At an unconscious level, it's a feeling. That's how you know your beliefs at your unconscious level. I feel like if I'm honest, it's possible, but it may not happen. It may be a rare occurrence for me to actually get that. It can happen, but I feel that I'm really stuck right now. And I just, I think it's a little bit of false hope a little bit, right? That could be an honest approach. So how do you feel on a scale of one to 10 that you can have that amount by the end of the month? Okay, we got six, seven, 10, eight, five, eight, nine, 10, five, 10. By the way, if you're at a 10, that means it's 100% certain. So without even doing anything for the rest of June, it will be in your account. That's how, that's how like 100% that is. So if you're at a 10, I would encourage you to rethink, maybe it's at a nine, maybe at like, am I really at that perfect belief level that if I did nothing, no inner work the rest of the month, it'll be there in my account, right? <clears throat> that's the idea, <clears throat> excuse me, of what a 10 symbolizes. Okay, great range here, it's perfect. Again, I just always give you everyone credit who's being very honest with, you know, looking at your numbers and everything. So some of you put in six or five or 10 or nine or eight, no matter where you're at, thanks for being honest about it and being blunt, because that's how you can learn about where you're at and then change it from here. So it's really great. So we're going to put on music for five minutes straight. It's a long time. Doesn't sound like a lot, five minutes, but it's a long time because what you're going to do is you're going to have a still image of your bank account increased by that amount of money. So your checking account, savings account, obviously later on you can move it to an investment account. However, you, it doesn't matter where you're going to put that money afterwards. I just want to say right now in your checking, savings account, whatever, you're going to see that amount increased. Or it can be an investment account. And you're going to keep that still image on the screen of your mind for five minutes. Those of you that have uh, the willpower not so developed just yet, it's going to be really hard. You're going to have doubts. You're going to have worries. You're going to have concerns. Your, mon your monkey mind is going to want to come in and chat with you. You're going to get distracted because you're like, oh, I forgot to make dinner tonight. Oh, what about that thing tomorrow, right? It's going to go nuts. Bring it right back to that still image, okay, for five minutes. We're going to put music on. And what you're going to repeat in your mind is thank you over and over and over. While the music's playing, I'm going to periodically say thank you in the microphone as well. So you're going to hear my voice when the music's going. And you're going to be in profound gratitude that this amount of money is already done in an alternative reality. Right now, it's not in your reality. It's not there. But in an alternative reality, it is. So you're just going to say thank you so much. Thank you so much to the universe. In an alternative reality, this is already done and how amazing that is. Everyone get the idea of the exercises? Any, any questions with that? Five minutes is a challenge. So let's get to it here. Do the best you can. There's no right. There's no wrong. Keep that still image saying thank you over and over and over, knowing that's in an alternative reality already there. <clears throat> 